This is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. And the cost of cruising is going up again. Cruisers heading to Cozumel and Costa Maya, Mexico, will soon face a new $5 fee per cruise passenger. Now, the governor of the region announced this fee starting in early 2025, and it'll be to support local tourism infrastructure and disaster preparedness. The fund, which will be managed by a new cruise tourism development fund, will allocate 70% to infrastructure projects and 30% to disaster response, with over 9.3 million cruise passengers expected in the two ports this year. The initiative aims to generate up to $25 million annually to grow Mexico's tourism. And a Texas man, Juan Campos, was arrested in South Florida over the weekend, accused of assaulting a woman on a cruise ship. Yeah, the incident allegedly occurred aboard Royal Caribbean's Freedom of the Seas, where the 28-year-old suspect and the 20-year-old victim were passengers. According to the arrest report, the woman claims that Campos assaulted her after she asked him to stop. Campos' attorney argues that when the victim said stop, Campos complied, denying the use of force or violence. The man was granted a $20,000 bond and remains in the Broward County Jail. And trouble in the med. Two U.S. Marines were assaulted by members of a radical anti-American group while off-duty in the cruise port of Izmir, Turkey. Now, the incident occurred during a routine port visit by the USS WASP. Ten individuals were arrested, with five more facing trial in connection with the attack, which is all captured on video and posted on Twitter by the group. In response, U.S. service members in Izmir were restricted to their ships as a precaution. This news comes as several cruise ships, including MSC Davina, Norwegian Getaway, and Seaborn Encore, are all scheduled to visit Izmir this month. Be safe out there. And cruise line stocks were down on Tuesday. Carnival Corporation down 1%, 16.34. Royal Caribbean down 3%, 159.65. Norwegian down 1.6%, 17.61. And Viking down 2.4, 32.75. If you have a lead on a story, let us know. Tips at cruiseradio.net. Here in Dallas, Texas, I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today.